three top shoulder pain stretches. Mm -hmm. This can help arthritis. It can help impingement. It mm -hmm. can rotate or cuff problems. Right. I think maybe labrum problems too. I think so think too. We, we call it the paddler because it's shoulder extension and you need a stick, a four or five foot long stick. We use a booyah stick. You don't have to have a booyah stick by any means. Stick. Broom stick. Yeah. Cane even works for this right. if it's long enough. Uh, and if you're paddling a canoe, you go like this. Just grab like I this. I can't win. Thumb will go forward and you grab here. Uh, the other hand is here and you just go straight behind you. If you look at this angle the profile of fuel it's here not out to the side and you just go back with a relaxed arm the involved arm that's getting stretched is completely relaxed and you go back give it a stretch a couple points here is if you start to feel pain you back off mm -hmm. you don't go into the pain cave if it starts to feel better go further and further yeah we want you to go as far as, the, as far as you can now i'm also going to add to that say you do it the first time and you hold it for a second or two. Oh, that kind of hurts. And then you just bump into it a couple more times and it starts to feel better. Well, then you can continue up to 10 repetitions. But if after two or three repetitions, it's just becoming more irritated, stop. Just disregard that stretch. And the first day, do one set of 10. Yep. And then see it how, how it is the second day. Right. If it feels fine the second day, you might do... Three sets of ten, like not in a row, like do a set of ten, yeah, throughout the, the day. Second one is the chicken wing. Sure, Bob, you want to demonstrate this? Sure, is, you really pretty much came up with this one. Yeah, I just so, came up with the name. So basically, you got palm on the lower. This is the arm that's giving me the problem. This left one. Yep, I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna, the palm is f facing out, away from your butt. Yep, this one, the palm is facing forward. And I don't want to hit my head, so I'm going to go off to the side of my head, and I'm going to take it and I'm going to pull the arm out into a chicken wing like you do in wrestling. Right, yeah. Brad? Well, yeah. And I will show you whatever if you're a wrestler, you say that. Now you can we'll put it, make it a little more stressful by going up further yep. and then going out. Sure. Right. Uh, can also. Yeah. To help loosen that shoulder. You could start up. with that one. Yeah. You could start by just going up and down like that, and and then eventually try this one. If yeah. it, it's not helping, you could do the other yeah. one. All right, now let's go to number three, the Statue of Liberty. Sure. Work. You reach up there, and when you lean forward, you you can't see it. My hand is gripping nice to the, ta to the stick. And as I lean forward, the leverage pulls traction, and it opens that gap up in the supraspinatus area underneath the uh, acromium 